Hello everyone, we're on step 35 of learning CSS colors by building a set of colored markers on freecodecamp.org. Now that you've gone through all the primary, secondary, and tertiary colors on a color wheel, it'll be easier to understand other color theory concepts and how they impact design. First, in the rules 1, 2, and 3, adjust the values in the RGB function so that the background color of each element is set to pure black. Remember, the RGB function uses additive color model. So... Colors start at black, and then change as the values increase, so black is when all of the values are at zero. So basically, we want to set all three values, red, green, and blue, to zero, and that will make the background color for all of them black, as you can see. Like that, and then we'll switch these to black, to zero, and zero like that. And that is it for this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.